a twin star from Multiplex with a seaplane conversion, a Polaris, oh that looks like a drone, T-Max, oh, better look at that Polaris. Big twin engine wing, oh, and the plane it goes on, down here, looks like we've got a, uh, looks like I've got a T-Max and a Revo. Over on the bench, definitely got a T-Max. Welcome to How To RC. This episode's about the T-Max. This T-Max here is an original T-Max, uh, one of the early ones, and it has an electric motor in it. Okay, there's a electric motor on a T-Max. Oh, we got plenty of room for a, for a battery under here. Put a battery right here underneath the motor. And this motor mount's got a tray for mounting the uh, ESC on it. That's pretty cool. The original T-Max, and um, it's got an electric motor in it. Let me zoom in on the motor. Electric motor and speed control. Zoom back out again and have the driver go. This is a T-Max 2.5 and it has an electric motor on it too. Um, this is the side mount. And there it is. The easy run. Little 540 motor which I really didn't believe would uh, uh, have the power to run this thing. Nice clean layout. Got a ton of room back here for batteries. Little two cell lipo in there. Cheap as I could find, easy run motor and speed control. Now it's a 4,000 kV motor. The ones we were running just a minute ago were like 34 and 3700 kV. And this thing just amazes me. I'll show you why. Uh, this is a T Max three point three with a stretch chassis. Dual steering servos and a 550 size brushless motor and ESC on the tall motor mount uh, is a nice option. Battery goes right in here. Just like that. That all these motor mounts all five of these motor mounts bolt right through holes that exist in the chassis. Matter of fact, they bolt right through the old motor mount holes. that and use the original motor mounting holes for our motor mounts. And so our motor mounts, any of them, will work on any T-Max. You want to see something that really goes? 
this thing really goes. This is a Revo. Got a uh, motor mount with a uh, battery, uh, ESC tray on top. Over on this side, we have a, a battery tray. Bolts right into existing holes, just like the T-Max mount. Same thing with the motor mount. The motor mount bolts right into existing holes in the chassis. There's four holes down here. Don't have to drill any holes. And we have brakes that work.